Three police chases in just 24 hours in Mobile, one on Government Boulevard yesterday. It involved a stolen vehicle and a suspect running from police. 18-year-old Kalija Clark is charged with receiving stolen property. This morning, a high-speed chase ended with several crashes and damage to police vehicles in West Mobile. This chase also involved a stolen vehicle. News 5's Katarina Lukatic shows us what happened on McLeod Road and why neighbors say they're not surprised. Sirens and police lights replaced alarm clocks for those who live along McLeod Road. I was just out on the deck around 4 and there was just some, uh, caught some red lights uh, off my shed there and I just figured it was a uh, ambulance or fire truck just going down the road. But it was actually the end of a high speed chase. Mobile police officers spotted a stolen vehicle around 3 this morning and chased it through the Dawes community until the Toyota crashed off the roadway, a police cruiser falling into a ditch as well. Neighbors say it isn't hard to believe this all started with a stolen car. It's not surprising because things always happen in this neighborhood, but I'm one of them that stay to myself a lot. There's a lot of theft in this area. Uh, house break-ins. Uh, matter of fact, uh, a couple of weeks ago I had a utility trailer, trailer stolen out of the yard here. Three people were taken into custody after the chase. The stolen car towed away. And while there were crashes and damage to several cruisers, fortunately, no one was hurt. In West Mobile, Katarina Luktich, WKRG News 5.